Hello everyone, and we are back after Damn. the crash. Yes, the welcome crash. back. There was a crash of 87. That's the crash of 22. Hey. So we're back here. Uh, this is what we're actually we're coming into. It's told them we're of course getting attacked by men. Yes, this time it's uh, bandits, I think. Yeah, it is bandits. Yeah. Like you are correct. Yeah. Yeah. Get the bed with me. So... We have to, uh, um, I'm we have to kill the guy again. Yeah. That's why we didn't start back right away, because we were just like, oh god, we gotta kill this guy. Okay. Yeah. Um, so we, we just kind of changed it again. This time a little more, a little more riskier. Than yeah. I'll kill you when you stand. This is kind of working. Uh. I don't know why I just. And you know. thought I was a pretty face. I don't want to die. Oh my gosh. Yeah, there we go. Through the bars? Holy shit. I'll see you in pieces. Okay, this is not working. Yeah, I'm gonna open the door. I'll kill you. <laughs> <laughs> she's got. Oh, she's got an ice staff. Oh my gosh. He's dead. Okay, we have another one. Oh, Abigail! Stop getting in the way, man! This must be the, the head, the... This must be their camp or something. Victory I want the staff though. Yeah, give me that. So now we're back out in Skyrim. Yes, we are back in the land of the cold. So what do we do now? We got the Elder Scroll. So now we have to go back to Parthenax. That should be easy enough, right? Yeah, we can fast travel. Ah, there we go. I was like, there's bound to be some sort of... Yeah, we'll just take all that. There's bound to be some sort of uh, loot here if it's a bandit camp. Yeah. Okay. Got a quick save. I'm, I'm quick saving a lot because of the crash that happened. I don't want to I don't want to lose anything. Yeah, it's a good idea. So I'm going to do a lot of quick saving. Oh, so it just saves the map markers to the actual map. Dang, so it does go like all the way almost to white run. It probably does go there. Since that's south, and I know there's a little bit further south in there. Probably goes like right under Dragon's Reach, too. Dang. Okay, so we also need to go back to Septimus. We're gonna go there first, because that'll be quick to finish up. Um, we were streaming when we saw Alduin, right? Or was that yeah, before we, were, we streamed? Yeah, we were streaming. Oh yeah, that's right, because we took an elevator up. Nice. Just what I want to see. Horse ass. Look. Fuck blizzards. Man, it didn't go away. It was starting to. So with luck, it should be gone by the time we get back. Okay, so I think um, after we're done with this, we actually get to meet one of the Daedra. So it's kind of cool. Hmm. Dig, Dwemer in the beyond. I'll know your lost unknown and rise to your depths. Why are you so eager to open the box? Ah, the box contains the heart. Ah, the essence of a god. 
to talk to me about this. I have devoted my to, life to, to our the right? elder scrolls. Yeah, I think so. But their knowledge is a passing awareness when compared to the encompassing mind of divinity. The Dwemer were the last to touch it. It was thought to have been destroyed by the Nerevarine, but my lord told me otherwise. Yeah, just what I was going to ask. Who is the your Daedric lord? The Daedric Prince of the Unknown, ah. Hermaeus Mora. I thought there were no secrets left to know until I first spoke that to makes him. That a lot of sense. He asks a price to work his will. A few murders, some dissent spread, a plague or two for the secrets I can endure. In time, he brought me here to the box. To the box? But he won't reveal how to open it. Maddening. I think it's because he doesn't know, maybe. I've been scrambling the lexicon. It quickly. Extraordinary. I see it now. The ceiling structure interlocks in the tiniest fractals. Dwemer blood can loose the hooks, but none alive remain to bear it. A panoply what? of their brethren could gather to form a facsimile. A trick. Something they did not anticipate. No, not even them. The blood of Altmer, Bosmer, Dunmer, Falmer, and Orsimer. <laughs> The elves still living provide the key. Bear you hence this extractor. It will drink the fresh blood of elves. Come when its set is complete. What? Okay. Man, I forgot about that. Okay, never mind. <laughs> we'll do that another time. Oh. What is going on here? Hey, Hermes Mora. What do you want? Come closer. I don't want to. Bask in my presence. I don't want to. I appreciate you from a distance, sir. I am Hermes Mora. I am the guardian of the unseen and knower of the unknown. I have been watching you, mortal. Most impressive. Aha. Uh -huh. so, yeah, what like do you way. want? Your you like the way we just aid that aid to Septimus body? renders him Ooh. increasingly <laughs> obsolete. He has served me well, but Jeez. his time is nearing its end. Once that infernal lockbox is opened, he will have exhausted his usefulness to me. When that time comes, you shall take his place as my emissary. Don't what pat say my shoulder you? with your disgusting little. Ugh. <laughs> Um, well, what do you think? What do you think she'd choose? I don't really know. Hmm. She kind of only cares about herself. But she's not against working for others if it works in her favor. Yeah. So if it's worth her while, which actually working for Hermaeus Mora, I think, does wind up being worth your while. Okay. So I think we'll go ahead and... Indeed. Agree. Speak with me when the box has been opened and all shall be revealed. Yeah, so we're gonna leave. We're gonna go uh, see Parthenax again, and never go back there. I mean, we will. Sounds like a good idea to me. We will go back there, but just not for make, a long while. I'm gonna go make me some more coffee. Oh, I thought you already made some more. Oh, okay. 
throat of the world. Oh, did like this? Did that mod just mess up our map all together? Where now we just move our map around weirdly? No, it has nothing to do with how we move the map. Um, it just puts the map markers from Blackreach um, onto. Oh, hey there. You're kind of terrifying. Parthenax, you're, you're kind of scary. Just coming up the mountain and you're just hanging out there, just staring me down. Man, from up here, though, the view is incredible. Like, chef's kiss. Mwah! Come here, come here and look at this real quick, though. Like, like, you're just, you're just coming up the mountain, you're looking down at the view, you're coming up here. And then, boom, right there. Oh my god. See? It's kind of terrifying. You have it. The Is Kel. Okay? Okay. Yes. The Elder Scroll. Yes, I, I have it, Tidkrech sir. Tidkrech Kalos. Time shudders at its touch. What is this, like, green There is no mist question. Going? You are doom-driven. Oh. oh, I see what Akatosh. you mean. Oh, it's weird. The very weird. bones of the earth are at your disposal. Go then. Fulfill Why your destiny. Like there was, like, a take the something. scroll to the time wound. Oh, okay, I'll take it to do the time wound. Do not delay. Alduin Don't. will be coming. He cannot miss the signs. Okay, do I have to manually do it? I guess I have to manually do it. We have so many books. What is that? Oh, just a unique book. Okay. Are we going back in time? Yes. Here we go. Honor your courage, Kreef Wolf Akrin. Die now in vain. Ancient Nord hero Frost dragon over there. Have you no Another thought beyond dragon. the blooding of your blade? <laughs> what else is there? The battle below goes ill. If Alduin does not rise to our challenge, I fear all may be lost. You worry too much, brother. Victory will be ours. Why oh, does Alduin goodness. hang back? We've staked everything on this plan of yours, old man. Old man. Oh, he hi. will come. He cannot ignore our defiance. And why yeah, should he feel us even now? He's gonna get well. Yeah, Four of his kin have fallen to my yeah, blade so alone this day. But uh, none have yet yeah, stood against like Aldor gross. himself. Balthor, Sori, Birker. He's an ancient graveyard. They did not have Dragonrend. Once we bring him down, I promise. Who, oddly I enough, does not have head. a gray beard. You do He's not understand. Alduin cannot be slain like a lesser dragon. He is beyond our strength. Which is why I brought the Elder Scroll. Feldir, we agreed not to use it. I never agreed. And if you are right, I will no, not need it. We will deal with Alduin ourselves, here and now. We shall see soon enough. Alduin approaches. She looks like uh, Ayla, so be the it. Huntress from the Companions. I wonder if she's like the same. <laughs> Um, character model. Let those that watch from Southern Guard envy us this day. Oh, oh. 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 
Eagle, Dragon Run. Finite. What have you done? Temporary. What twisted oh. worlds have you created? Taro Despard locks my teeth to his neck. But first, dear Kumar. Die in terror, knowing your final fate. To feed my power, I come for you in Southern if I die today, it will not be in terror. You feel oh, the first time, Worm. I see it in your eyes. Skyrim will be free! Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, he flung her off the mountain. She's dead. It's no use. Oh, it's not oh, it's not the will kill me. No. Hold, Alderman on the wing! Sister Hawk, grant us your sacred breath to make this contract hers! Be gone, world! By words with all your bones than your own, we break your perch on this age and send you out! You are banished! I want it! We shout you out from all our enemies on the water. About 3 p.m.? Interesting. Work. You did it. Yes. The World Eater is gone. May the spirits have mercy on our souls. Alright. Now we get to fight all the ones. So what's interesting, um, I want to point out, the words for Dragonrend are what you would think would be simple words. They're mortal, finite, and temporary. But the reason why these are so, these words are so deadly to the dragon in a fight is actually because these are concepts that dragons don't understand. Um, because they themselves are immortal. They're all immortal, technically speaking. So, mortality um, conflicts with their being. Um, uh, affinity, if that's how you would pronounce it, I guess. Infinity, so finity, I guess. Um... <laughs> is also a concept that conflicts with their very being. And temporary um, also conflicts with their very being because they are, themselves are immortal, they are infinite, and they are non-temporary, they're forever. So, I really love that. I never actually paid attention to those words. Okay, I need bow. And Ooh, I need... summon the summon the the ballista. Oh, you're right. It's probably a good idea. Lost fool, you are too. It's Alduin. Now let's hope we don't get the glitch where we can't do any damage to him. Did I get him? I think I missed him. Tom Park Nets, kick his ass. 
looks like he's shit right now. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Surprised he hasn't done his storm call already. <laughs> oh, was that it? Yeah, that was it. Fudge. Oh, but it's daytime. Weird. <gasps> Was I need to heal it? real quick. Do they usually do this at night? Like, what's happening? Um, I don't think so. I just don't think it's normally this bright. That makes any sense. I must have gotten it. Okay, yeah, here it is. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh no! I just <sighs> yeah, hit I hit the hard. damn button and it didn't freaking listen to me. Okay. I don't give a shit. Yeah, I don't know if you want some of the ballista or you want some of the big guy. I want some in the ballista because that way it can at least shoot him. Was it wor was it working the last time? I don't know. Alright guys, attempt two. Let's see if this time we got him. Get rid of these ones that I don't need right now. Hold on a second, guys. Blue screen. Thank you, three viewers, for sticking around. It's been great so far. Man, that that pisses me off. Whoa, it's now it's red out here. Okay, we did all that shit. Now we gotta do it again. Yeah, whatever, whatever. We'll use a 
poison. Could and you hit him for mark for death? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. Besides, right now, we're not actually trying to kill him, kill him. Oh, okay. You talk too much. Die now and Come on. Come on, bitch. Lost foot. You are too right, let's late. See if we have the That time I just missed him. Do we What is We have the on? fucking glitch. Again. Okay. Get back Friend. fucking down here. Get your ass back down here. We're gonna have to reload from fucking before. Why did I have to the first I don't know, but it's fucking bullshit, so we can't do anything. Yeah, fuck you. Whatever. Yeah, whatever, I'm on fire, I'm gonna die, whatever. I can't fucking do shit to you anyway. Man. That's the most infuriating thing. My first fucking playthrough. I never beat the game because... I had this glitch right off the bat. Look at Karima. She's like holding her back paws with her front paws. It looks like she's holding onto her tootsies. Okay. I want to see real quick. It's going to be blue screen again for a minute, guys. When's the last time we saved before that? Oh, I don't know. Um... We're going to reload this one. Sorry guys about the blue screen tonight. We're just getting yeah, frustrated. Yeah, we're just tonight. getting we're just getting kind of fucked over. Okay, so okay, it's before so or after. It's it's before. It's not oh. it can't be after. We didn't do anything after. Oh. Okay, so we're going to fast travel back there. Wait, before or after what do you mean? Is that before or after we already did the stuff inside? We already did the stuff inside. Okay. By the way, tonight Ko is wearing a nice mask on her face, and it looks like it's very dry. It is. It's actually like, um, chipping. <laughs> okay. I'm going to quick save right here. It probably feels great, though, doesn't it? It will once I rinse it off. You have it. The Kel. Okay, so we gotta do the time wound thing again. Oh, this is gonna take freaking forever. Ooh. I envy the guys who are watching in the future right now who Right, who can who can just like skip ahead a little bit? No, who's gonna get a wonderful time lapse of us trying to do this all again. Oh, Lucky them. Watch all time 10 speed. Gormley. I might even put a few pictures of caramel to look at because it seems like it. Dar su fuse outuin to clean. Today Alduin's lordship will be restored. Alright, since we're doing this again, I'll leave the worries. controller in your control, and I'm gonna go actually rinse my mask off real quick. Okay, I'll be right back. 
A glorious day, is it not? Have you no thought beyond the blooding of your blade? <laughs> what else is there? The battle below goes ill. If Alduin does not rise to our challenge, I fear all may be lost. You worry too much, brother. Victory will be ours. Why does Alduin hang back? We've staked everything on this plan of yours, old man. He will come. He cannot ignore our defiance. And why should he fear us, even now? We blooded him well. Four of his kin have fallen to my blade alone this day. But none have yet stood against Alduin himself. Galthor, Sori, Birker. They did not have Dragonrand. Once we bring him down, I promise. I will have his head. You do not understand. Alduin cannot be slain like a lesser dragon. He is beyond our strength. Which is why I brought the Elder Scroll. Feldir, we agreed not to use it. I never agreed. And if you are right, I will no, not need it. We will deal with Alduin ourselves, here and now. We shall see soon enough. Alduin approaches. So be it. Let those that watch from Savengard envy us this day! Not be in terror. You feel that for the first time, Worm. And it's still not over. It's still going. Skyrim will be free! So apparently, this is a single new program. Oh, damn you. It's no use. It's smoke, no use. Hold Alduin on the wing. Sister Hawk, grant us your sacred guess to make this too, contract heard. Be gone, World Eater. In my words with older I was gonna guess you maybe like, uh... Break your perch on this age and so I'm here while trying to, like, break You are in banished. So I like things like something we happened. He was trying to break into All our endings okay. until the last. You are banished! Interesting. Everybody's a little bit mad about that, by the way. Work. Why? Just like, you did it. Oh, oh, okay. Yes. So, you know. The world eater is gone. Everybody thinks it's hilarious that it's happening, but there's souls. a bunch of people who are just like, you know, if it was a female Marvel character, everybody would be Well, because it's Thor, it's fine. <laughs> Why do you think they did it to a male character instead of a female character? Because. <sighs> <sighs> okay. I don't want to quick save here because if I do, it might fuck it up. Oh, we should have quick save before we did the time thing. I we? did. Oh, okay. I didn't do it right okay. before, but I did it like before we walked up onto Honestly, the area. Dwar so. Dwarf and Ballista, I don't know how well you are actually doing. We'll see. But we'll see. I'm not even sure how well Abigail was doing. It was. 
kind oh, of a I don't mess know. right now. Ah, uh, poison, I guess. Dude, is this magic? Fortify health. Don't mind us, guys. We're really, we're really trying to get ready. True shot. And poison. Lost fools, you are too late, Oh, oh, he's taking damage. Good. Oh yeah. Good. That's okay. My power has waxed. Or talk to Arngear, or talk to Esbern. How about I talk to all three? Cause fuck you. Lot Kongrach, you truly have the voice of a Dova. Alduin's allies will think twice after this victory. Yeah, but it's still not over, is it? Yeah, it wasn't really a victory since Alduin escaped. Nilivrach in Moro. True, this is not the final Krongra victory. I like but that word. not even the heroes of old were able to defeat Alduin in open battle. Alduin always was Pahlok, arrogant in his power. Usnagar Par. He took domination I love the, as his the words. birthright. This should shake the loyalty of the Dove who serve him. Oh, five viewers. Thank you, guys. Hey! Thanks for watching, guys. I need to find yes. out where he went. One of his allies could tell us. Mat Mahus. But it will not be so easy to convince one of them to betray him. Perhaps the Haf Kasayun, the palace in Whiterun, Dragon's Reach. It was originally built to house a captive Dova. Mm -hmm. A fine place to trap one of Alduin's allies, hmm? Sure. Who am I trapping? Hmm, yes. <laughs> yeah, but yeah your that's a good point. Is strong. Might want to include him in the plans. I do not doubt that you can convince him of the need. My Soom? Okay, so I know what Thum is. What is Soom? Hmm, I don't know. Yes. This was ages ago, you understand. There were more of us then. Before the Bruniki, the Akaviri came and killed all my Zemp. I used to visit him from time to time, nearly crazed okay. by loneliness and captivity. Tiraz Sivaz. He did not even remember his own name. Oh, damn. I do not know how he came to be caught, but the Bronyun, the Jarl, was very proud of his pet. Pa. Hmm. The Hofkasayun has been known as Dragon's Reach ever since. That's a word. Sum Ark Mora. Sum Ark Mora. 
I have no clue what that means. Nope, no idea. But hey, we did it! So, we're gonna quick save. And then we're gonna fast travel. Actually, damn it, no, I wanted to talk to Arngear also while we were there. I mean, I would have fast traveled anyway to High Hrothgar. Because it's a little bit of a walk downhill. Because I want to know what more they would be able to tell me. Um, so yeah, I'm going to fast travel again. Just up to High Hrothgar. Okay. And we've already talked about Whoa. how our character, our character is so gonna, cool. our character is gonna favor the the graybeards over the blades. So that makes sense. Probably. I'm I'm still a little bit open because I feel like our character would be a little bit um, open to seeing just like what happens. Um, <clears throat> I think it's really gonna come down to like from where can we get the most power for No fucking. Oh yes, they talk to me now. Oh that's awesome. I love that. Like they don't really talk to me, but they speak. They whisper of oh, the ebony warrior. I can't see shit. Ebony warrior? He might have been useful earlier against that troll guy, not gonna, against that uh, troll guy. You know guy, what? Not gonna lie. Yeah. I mean. Brilliant. Before. Okay. So before. Yeah, I smile on you, friend. He was OP because we were a really low level, mm -hmm. and he's always at like mm -hmm. level eighty. Mm -hmm. I mean, we're like level thirty now. But we're going had, against like really yes. high level. That guy had to have been level 80 or something. Especially like modded enemies as well are like yes. super high level. So do you think maybe we change our minds and we go with Ebony Warrior now? What do you now? need? Maybe. We just mm -hmm. have to. We'll do it after the stream. We won't do it like right we'll now part, on we'll stream. Part way of that. Well, I'd like to do it on stream to kind of part ways with Abigail. I mean, like, getting all the stuff from her inventory and everything. Oh god, you're gonna take the whole fucking hallway. <laughs> I'm glad we didn't summon the giant contraption. Bori. Are the rest of them oh, outside? Yes. No, that's the merchant. It might be outside. Oh, wait, wait. Iron gear? No, that's Wolfgar. Wait, are you gonna speak to me? No fucking. Oh, I love it, because it shakes the whole mountain. I love it so much, with just a whisper, because they're so damn powerful. Arngear, is he going to be up in the freaking mountain again? Who was last time? Mountain. There. <sighs> Words. But then Tower. About, the thing Tower. about the Ebony Warrior is eventually when we get high enough level, he's going to look for us to kill him. Yeah. Okay, nobody's up here. No. So, what will that do? I don't know. What level is that? Is it like more level 80? Yes, as soon as we become level 80. Because there's, there's always Abigail, but then also there's Faith in the... Uh... Kind of makes me wonder, are there two Ebony Warriors? Maybe. Since, since we've got the mods... There's a... There's that also, makes him a follower, you know? There's also Faith that okay, walks so around... Okay, uh, the other side. There's also Faith that walks around White Run, who has a summoning spell to summon dra dragon bone armor for herself. Oh, there's a one. That's Einar. No fucking. No fucking. Love it. I love Somehow it so walk much. around this uh, this 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 sent this uh this dwarven sentinel. Actually, isn't that bad? I've noticed. Yeah. Are you gonna slide past the merchant again? Need something. Oh, hey. There's the modded guy. He was the one that had anger issues. Is this still boring? Yeah. 
Where he would just run out and Oh, just, yeah, like, he would just fucking kill everyone and everything. The first thing, he, he would see something, a deer runs by, and he would foost or die right away. Right. And he would just keep going and doing it every single time he could. Every, yeah. Like, he'd throw things off of cliffs and... Oh! Aldwin, we heard the dragon run shout from here. You defeated I'm just, him? I'm just sleeping oh, in my I friend wish. the ebony warrior's bed. Yes, but he escaped. I need to find his portal to summon him. I feared as much. I thought it was him we saw flying east after your battle. I'm going to try to capture a dragon, if Balgruf will help me. Ah, dragon's reach. There are many difficulties, but I cannot think of a better plan. Although I fear the Jarl may not be easy to persuade. Remember, the way of the voice trains you for more than battle. Indeed, we believe that battle is the least of its uses. May the strength and truth of your voice serve you well. Breath and focus. Where has Alduin gone? The old tales say that he can travel into Sovereign God to devour the souls of the dead. You must find yeah. out how he does this before he regains his strength and returns. It's really cool. Breath and focus. So I'm pretty sure the whole thing with Alduin is supposed to be based off of... Um, oh, what's it called? Ragnarok. The whole thing um, of... If you know... Where, like, it, it can't actually be stopped. It can only be delayed. Yeah. Um, where am I going? Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. I remember. Skyhaven Temple, because now I want to talk to, um, what's his fucking name? You know, the guy. The Blades guy. Um. I have no idea. Esburn? Esburn, yes. Um. But. Ragnarok. I, I think this is supposed to be based off of Ragnarok, because, um, firstly, it's, like, all based off of like Norse mythology the whole um Nord culture is kind of based off of Norse or I mean kind of obviously uh hi guys mythology brilliant yes they're talking yes. to me as if I'm casting a spell may Excuse the gods me? watch over your battles oh. friend that's why you're named. Okay. Treehawk. Treehawk. Oh, right. I wonder if that's a, a gamer tag what time or is if it? that's a. 8:51 a.m. So they must. Same. They'll probably be outside. No, we could. Now that we're releasing Abigail, we could give her to the blades. We could. By followers, primes, and viewers on mountviewers.com. Sorry, not interested. If you want to stick around and follow, go ahead and do it, but I'm not really interested in taking ads from somebody just trying to sell followers, so. Yeah. Appreciate it, but uh, no thank you. We're not interested in in buying any followers. Yeah, feel free to follow yourself, though, man. Yeah. Delphine, where's Esburn? Esburn, where are you? Well, I guess maybe he's still inside then. But we're just in there. Well, maybe he's in uh, one of the rooms. We you didn't know go what? into Sometimes the rooms. he's in the mess hall area. Not the yeah, mess hall, that's the kitchen area. That's what I'm thinking. It's a big place, by the way. It is. I mean, it's really no bigger than High Hrothgar. I, I like it a but, lot. I like it the yes. way it's filled it up with people. What do you want? This is the mod, though. It's not. Oh, he's asleep. Did you yeah, find but I, I like that they filled scroll. it up with people because now it what feels just as lively as higher up. You took it is. back to the throat of the world. Even more so, actually. There is more of these Defeated guys. Alduin, but he escaped. I need to find he must him. have returned to Sovngarde to feed on the souls of the dead. If you don't find him soon, 
He'll return stronger than ever. Don't worry, I have a plan. I'm going to track a, trap a dragon in Dragon's Reach. The Jarl's Vanishing White That's Run? Ah, oh, yes. The old story about King Olaf's pet dragon. Ingenious. Although, it might be difficult to persuade the Jarl to allow you to use his palace as a dragon farm. I'm sure you'll manage, though. If you can defeat the World Eater, surely sweet-talking the Jarl of Whiterun isn't beyond. <laughs> I'm afraid okay. there's a further problem, a serious one. I've discovered who the Greybeard's leader really is. To be fair, sir, really we're his bane, so I think it won't be that bad. You've discovered what? He's a dragon. Not just any dragon, but the right hand of Aldred, responsible for many atrocities during the ancient dragon war. The blades have been hunting him for centuries, but he was protected by the Greybeards oh. and then the emperors. Justice demands that he die for his crimes. Until he is dead, I'm afraid my oath as a blade prevents. Oh, him you're giving from me the choice feet. already? I thought. Oh, I thought you didn't. Give me that choice until after I killed Alduin. Haven't you been listening to me? All the old tales yeah, agree you, that he man. has some means to travel to Sovngarde itself. But there, I can't justify he killing, the souls nah. of the heroic killing, dead. killing Parthenax. has done nothing wrong. Right, like but he, like our character yes. character has a moral Before compass he where, he yeah, she's not, like, than ever. a good person. But she's also not gonna, like... Justice can be harsh. No, I don't think justice. he does. Parthenax deserves to die. Like, why does he need to Parthenax die? Parthenax was the author of many atrocities. During we the only kill other dragons Crimes because they attack us. Be We're not someone that goes looking for fights. True, mm -hmm. he turned traitor to Aldrin and helped overthrow the dragon cult. But that does not excuse or expiate his previous deeds. Whether but if he was a human, he wouldn't you say that that merely acted to save himself. Justice demands that he pay with his life. That's all. Hmm? Well, fuck you. I'm gonna talk to um, Delphine and see what she has to say about Parthenax. Because I'm curious what she has to say about it at the moment. Not because I'm going to listen to her or anything. How did, I won't. How to discover God a damn it, where'd she go? How did discover Parthenax was up there anyway? I don't know. I don't know how he discovered that Parthenax was a dragon. Because it would only be us and the Greybeards that would know. Oh, there she is. I'll look at you up and about now. Delphine. My oath binds me, Dragonborn. Until Parthenax is dead, you aren't welcome here. Damn, fuck you, bitch. About Parthenax. Make your choice, Dragonborn. You're either with us or against us. But why? Why does he Here's the that? big picture. He helped Alduin enslave our ancestors. He may have betrayed Alduin in the end, but that makes him worse. How does that make him worse? We can't what? afford to give Parthenax the opportunity to betray, to betray us in turn. What? And return to his old master. Nah. He's sat up there for hundreds of years. I don't think he cares. If he wanted to betray us, he would have by now. Right. Because he's a freaking dragon. You know, like, he's been up there for so long. If he wanted to, like, enslave humanity again, he could have twice right. over how long he's been up there. Right, he's just been fucking hanging out. Like, he's much more of, like, a guru type of deal, you know? Right, he's like... He's like the OG. He doesn't want to fight. He just has to fight right now. Yeah. And I mean, look at him. He just fought Alduin with us. All right, let's go to Dragon. And Ridge. I think our character would, would respect that because I think so too. Especially, especially considering the fact that the blades kind of don't have much to offer us. Not only in the sense of of power. Like, our character is definitely someone who will kind of go where she can get more powerful. Mm -hmm. um, dragon shouts are a thing that do that. And, and look the blades, right, the blades don't ever tell us, I don't think. They never, they never tell us, like, oh, 
Yeah, I, I, like the Greybeards will will have that dialogue of we've heard the whisper of a word hidden in this in this ancient place. Go here to find the word of power, and they'll like almost infinitely give you that Another until you wanderer. found them here all. Like my father's and good job. You know, they can even, like, share oh, their wisdom with you and such. Did you slip out again such? last night for a drink at the Bannered Mare? that Mare. magic away from me. These secret visits to the tavern will make you... They think the lamp is... The lantern is magic. Because oh. I guess it's... I guess it's sense. added... Um, stop me from I guess it's, like... Categorized as, like, a magic spell. So it's just, mm. like, you wear this item and it casts a permanent magic spell. Uh, I must have misheard you. I thought you asked me to help you trap a dragon in my palace. Yes, sir. You know I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. You How heard our... right, it's the only way to stop the dragon. Can we stop... I'm gonna persuade him. I was huh. gonna say, can we drink a, a flippin' a potion for for haggling real quick? Um, I don't think that's gonna do anything okay. for this. But usually persuasions and intimidations work. Okay. Usually, so... Of course. You already saved White Run from that dragon. Yes. I owe you a great deal. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. But I don't understand. Uh -huh. Why let a dragon into the heart uh -huh. of my city when we've been working so hard to keep them out? Yes, I understand. I understand. The threat is worse than you know. Alduin has returned. Alduin. The world eater himself. But how can we fight him? Doesn't his return mean it's the end times? I'm dragonborn. It's my destiny to stop him. Or it's only hopeless if we give up. I think this provides a bit more of a solution than this, and I'm very solution-driven, and I imagine our character is too. I think so, yeah. I'm dragonborn. It's my destiny to stop him. I don't know about such things, but I heard the Greybeard summon you. That's good enough for me. Yes, sir. Now, what's this nonsense about trapping a dragon in my palace? It's the only way to find Alduin before it's too late. I want to help you, Dragonborn. And yes. I will. But I need your help first. Uh, yeah. with what? Ulfric and General Tullius are both just waiting for me to make a wrong move. Do you think they will sit idle while a dragon is slaughtering my men and burning my city? No. I can't risk weakening um. the city while we are under the threat of enemy attack. Sorry. What if you didn't have to worry about an enemy attack? Then I would be glad to help you with your mad dragon trapping scheme, but getting both sides to agree to a truce will be difficult at this point. The bitterness has gone too deep. Maybe. Hmm. What of the Greybeards? They are respected by all Nords. High Hrothgar is neutral territory. If the Greybeards were like willing she's to just host like a peace permanently council, rolling her eyes right now. Then maybe yeah. <laughs> of Tullius would have to listen. Good idea. Okay, yeah. We'll do that. I Dragonborn. Maybe you can stop the dragons and this war. What's interesting though fire. is that you don't have to do this if you do the civil war quest beforehand. Oh. You okay. don't have to do that. But I kind of prefer doing it. Mm. Um... Now, okay, if I won't you ask mind, him that. I've got a city to keep. Oh, hey, hi. Ain't nobody high and mighty in these halls You're... except in the yard. Okay, carrying a truck. Don't you forget. What the hell are you doing in here, Nazim? Do you get to the Cloud District very often? Oh, what am I saying? Of course don't you even don't. Think You're only it. here as a visitor. What's your problem with the Zim? Did you not just hear me? Wait, is he hiding behind the door again? No. Oh, there no, he is. Over there. <laughs> Brilliant. Hiding in the corner. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing Earlier. hostilities. Like the Earlier rest in of my great game, I, I went over to see Farangar, and I you know, I literally walked the into his room. I looked me. this oh, way, didn't know. see him. And I was in I was in third person, so I looked this way, didn't see him, so I turned this way to leave. But he was standing right here, 
So I didn't see <laughs> him when I looked this way, but I saw him once I turned, and I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> but he was just it sitting there hiding behind his con- door. It was so funny. Kind of magic, don't you think? It is simply energy to be harnessed um, by those with actually, the will and knowledge to do so. Actually, I don't think we need anything from you at the moment. So, uh, bye. Goodbye, court wizard. See you next time. Alright, so I think I'm going to talk to Arngear again. Okay. And then... Hmm? I'm gonna go use the bathroom. Okay. Are you getting tired? A little bit. Okay. Because I'm thinking about getting to a stopping point. Okay, sounds good to me. So I'm going to talk to Arngear about setting up the peace treaty um, and getting both sides to uh, to come to High Hrothgar. Um, and then we might go ahead and visit both parties and tell them to come. And then I think we'll end there. I don't think we'll go through the actual meeting yet Bori Master Bori um, I don't think we'll go through the actual council yet because that might that it Divine not it might it is a lengthy process wind guide you okay oh I have a few things I want to talk to you about actually the blades want me to kill Parthenex now you see why I've warned you against them. Bloodthirsty yes. barbarians. Yes, Master Arngear, I see. Is it true what they said? Was he Alduin's ally? I already yes. know the... Yes. But understand, I already know the during answer to the that. days of Alduin's rule, all dragons were his allies. There was nothing else they could be. If not for Parthenax, Alduin could not have been overthrown. It was he that first taught men to use the Thum. He still needs to pay for his crimes. I haven't decided what to do yet. Ah, you're learning, Dragonborn. Doing nothing can be the wisest choice, although strangely often the most difficult. I trust that you will make the right choice in the end. Listen to the voice that Kinnereth has placed within you, and your path will be clear. We already had this conversation. Okay. Need your help to stop the you war. You misunderstand our authority. The Greybeards have never involved themselves in political affairs. Jarl Balgruf won't help me while the war rages. I see. The dragon will lead you to Alduin, but without the Jarl's help. Both sides respect the Greybeards. They will listen. Artanax has made the decision to help you. This is the road we have to walk. Yes, Even sir. the Greybeards must bend to the winds of change, it seems. Yes, Master. So be it. Tell Ulfric and General Tullius that the Greybeards wish to speak to them. We will see if they still remember us. Would... Would General Tullius know? Are you ready? Deliver the message to the warring parties. If they will listen, I will do what I can to bring them to terms. Yes, but understand, during the days of Alduin, if not for Parthenax, yes, Alduin already... could not have been overthrown. Ah, I trust that you will make the right choice. In okay. The end. Listen Brilliant. to the voice that Kinnereth has placed within. Really quickly. I actually want to fast travel up to the third of the world and talk to Parthenax and see if we can discuss with him about the blades and what they want us to do. Okay, he's not up on this little perch. Ah, oh, there he is. Hello, Parthenax. Drem your lock. Greetings. The blades say you deserve to die. The blades are wise not to trust me. Only Khan Miov. I would not trust another Dova. 
Why shouldn't they trust you? Dov Walan Farel. We were made to dominate. The will to power is in our blood. You feel it in yourself, do you not? I guess so. I can be trusted. I know this, but they do not. Only Khan Niovdova. It is always wise to mistrust a Dova. I have okay. overcome my nature only through meditation and long study of the way of the voice. No day goes by where I am not tempted to return to my inborn nature. Zin Griforwut se Suliek. What is better, to be born good or to overcome your evil nature through great effort? Okay. Shum Ark Mora. So I guess that's all there is about that. Windhelm. I think we'll go to Windhelm first. Because I think. Seeing as Ulfric had studied with the Greybeards years ago, I think he might be the easiest to convince. I don't imagine that General Tullius would really have any such respect for the Greybeards. So for him, huh. it will probably be more of like, uh, if, if Ulfric is there, then I'll go too. If he's willing to do some sort of peace treaty. Um, really quickly. Riften. Okay. I must be thinking of my my game. My private game. Um, cuz I current my my current uh yes? Thieves Guild missions are in Windhelm. In my game, so I wanted to double check. All right, so this is our first time being in here. He'll come around. Only the foolish okay. or the courageous so good thing that I can interrupt that. I didn't know if I could. Do I know you? Um, yes, we've already met. Is that so? Uh, yes. You were with us at Helgen. Destined for the chopping block, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, no. Rayloff's alive. I hope that's true. He's a damn I'm not man, fighting but he the hasn't Empire. returned yet. So I'll need to wait for his account. For now, speak with Gama. I'm Actually, always looking for able fighters. Not everyone can say they made it out of home. Um, I'm not here to join. Seems we're all branded villains these uh, days. Uh, I'm not So long as your criminal past stays uh, I'm not past. And you fight sir? for me with honor and integrity. Sir, I'm not we'll no. welcome you into our ranks. I'm not here to join. What's no, going on? I'm not here to join. I have a message. Uh, the top one or the white one? Yeah. I just wanted to see what the other ones oh, okay. were. I have a message from the Greybeards. It's about time they turned their gaze from the heavens back to our bleeding homeland. What do they want? Ah, so maybe he doesn't respect them that much after all. They want to negotiate a truce and until the dragon menace... Eh. Until the dragon menace is dealt with. I have the greatest respect for the Greybeards, of course. Yeah, I hope so. And the dragon attacks are a growing plague. Yep. But the political situation is still delicate. Not all the Jarls are fully and they won't to be. supporting me as high not, You're not going to please I everyone, sir. I can't afford sir. to appear weak. I can't agree to this unless uh. Tullius himself will be there. Politics be damned! Alduin has returned. Alduin. Ah. Uh, the hey, there we go. Legend. If that's true, of well, course it does. Changes the situation, Look doesn't it? Even Tullius may be forced to talk sense in the face of such a threat. 
Yes. So you'll come to yes. the Peace Council. I'll give Tolius one more chance to quit Skyrim with his tail between oh, his God. legs. I hate this guy. What would you hate him so much. Okay. If he's not out of here, our character bitches. Our character's not a big fan of the Civil War, so her stepping into this is very much out of her comfort zone, and she probably sees this as just a couple of uh, a couple of men just being macho about problems. Yes, exactly. Much smaller problems. And I know, I know, you're seeing me even get a little bit into character, like, oh, he won't shut up about the stupid war. <laughs> It's just what happens, but she's just not into it. She doesn't care. She's not really a part of it in any way. It doesn't get her to her major goal. She just... She's neutral. She's not on either side. Right. So whatever side can give her more power, that's basically what she would sit, honestly. Right. And right now, currently, that's neither because it doesn't do anything for her at all. Oh, there's hip there. Oh, wow, I guess. Look at all the me when you get bored, yeah, I guess he's in. Um, mm -hmm. Oh god, there's so what many do you people. Want, little elf? Some busy streets today. Castle Dower. That's what it's called. Forgot the name of it. So there's Castle Dower, and then there's also the Blue Palace. So I guess. Oh, was. It? Whoa, dude, you alright? <laughs> you alright? David the Bowie. I'm, I'm a sword man myself. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> okay. He'd okay. be insane to General try. Tullius. I remember you. You okay. were at Helgen. You, uh, Speak to uh, Legged Ricka. I suspect we could use what? someone like you. Not what? That's not why I'm here. You see. Thank you for giving then me the option. General to Tullius, if you change you were your mind, to speak to Legged. So, um, right. She's not a fan of the the Imperials. She just doesn't want to associate with them because of that sticky Real situation. Real quick, um, what will it take to end the war? Ulfric Stormcloak's head rolling away oh, from God. his lifeless body. Oh, God, so you're body. not to be reasoned with either. Okay, I have a message from the Greybeards. What do those old hermits want with me? They're convening a peace council at High Herothra. Why? There's nothing to discuss as long as that traitor Ulfric is in arms against his rightful emperor. We need a truce until the dragon menace is dealt with. They are getting to be a problem. But I wasn't sent to Skyrim to fight dragons. Well, My unfortunately, they're going to fight you, bitch. And I intend to do so just that. you got to deal with it. Or no dragons. The dragons are a bigger problem than the Stormcloaks right now. Uh, the best time to negotiate is from prison. Ulfric has already granted to... I'm going to... Go top. The dragons are a bigger prob problem than the Stormcloaks right now. Right? You may have a point. It's getting difficult to even move troops around without attracting uh -huh. a dragon attack. By all accounts, the Stormcloaks are suffering just as badly. Yes. Even Ulfric might see the sense of a truce under these conditions. Yes. He's already agreed to it. You'll come to the Peace Council yes. then. Yes, fine. I'll come to this Greybeard Council. For all the good it will do. I want so badly to stick a dagger through your throat. Report, sir. Every day more join his but I'm resisting. Drifting, so him and, and Ulfrig are considered to be uh, him the and... The leaders, uh, I guess. Yeah. Oh, look, he's actually going. Oh, he's walking there immediately. That's nice. Someone actually gives a shit. Is this talking here? And they're, uh, Probably. and they're considered essential, correct? I believe so. I've been looking for oh, you. Ah, Got something ah. I'm supposed to deliver. You're what do you want? Only. Let's see here. I have a letter here for you. Vigilant Looks like that's it. Got to go. Huh? What? Um. I expected that to be from a Jarl. From Vigilant of Stendar. Blake Ravenwood, you may or may not realize this, but by taking care of Vampire's Thrall, you have indirectly helped me. Huh. Don't worry about how I know it was you. I won't be informing the authorities, but I would like you I would like to reward you for your efforts. Please visit me at your earliest convenience. 
How'd they know about us killing the, the vampires and... Okay, so this is actually funny. I think this is a random thing. Like, it's a random person that would want another random person dead. Because Vampire's Thrall is not a specific person. Isn't that what It's we... just the name of a type of person that we've happened to kill several of. Yes. So I guess and, and... there was a random connection, I guess. I mean, it makes sense because Vigilance of Stendar, like, just have... They, they hate vampires and their thralls and werewolves and Daedra and all of that stuff. Um, so maybe it's like all Vigilance of Stendar already have like a, a already like pre um, what's the word? Pre-programmed um, like vendetta against each individual that they would fight against. So, I'm guessing this is a random thing. Um, and it could be like, if you kill someone, if someone else happens to have a bad, um, Words are failing me right now. Not discernment. Um, disposition. That's the word. A bad disposition or a negative disposition towards that person. You can, like, randomly get this letter from them. Oh, okay. I guess. Cool. So. Cool. Nope. Sorry. Yeah. Are we at the stopping point yet? Just about. Kill Parthenax. No, thank you. Talk to Iron Gear. I wonder if that's. Nope. It's not even in our thing. Hmm. We have a couple of uh, words of power to learn, though. Source of power in Dead Man's Respite. And also in Arkwind Point. So we do have a couple of words to learn still. We'll probably do that after killing Alduin. We'll, like, um, we'll do a stream where we just go around and find all of the words of power. We might do, like, a long stream on a weekend or something for that okay but um as for tonight i think we're at a good stopping point if i can jump over here oh god okay that wasn't so bad away from me. yeah yeah whatever divines bless you may the ground you okay we're going to real quick we're gonna go ahead and fast travel outside of high hrothgar so that we're already there quake is the Ritual Stone power lets you temporarily resurrect nearby corpses to fight for you once a day. While I was on the Skyrim Reddit, I also saw a clip of, um... Oh, hello horse. I thought you were a bear for a moment for some reason. Oh, is this them? Oh, it's Esbern and Delphine. What are you guys doing here? I didn't fucking talk to you. Bitches, I don't want you here. And make me fucking kill Parthenax. I don't need to kill Parthenax. I might kill you. Anyway. We're gonna go ahead and just perch ourselves right here. And that's gonna be all for this time, guys. Thank you for sticking around for this uh, lengthy two part video stream that kind of happened on and off with the uh, technical difficulties that we were having. Apologies about all that. All the blue screens will be cut out or at least fast forwarded or something in the edited version, I assume. So, uh, yeah, that's it. 
Yep. Thanks for watching. Thanks for everything, guys. Hope, Hope you enjoyed. Exactly. Hope you tune in next time, next Tuesday. Next although I'm not Tuesday. not entirely sure if I can wait that long. We'll so, see. Skyrim Tuesday and Thursday, and then if Coda really wants to, she could do something on the weekends. Hey. I might. I might so, have to do something on Saturday. We'll and, see. And no them. promises, but we'll see. Do keep in mind, we have Friendcraft Friday coming up on Friday, and then on Saturday, me and CM Gamer are returning with wrestling content around 2 yep. o'clock, so make sure and stay tuned for that. I've been working hard on it, and it's going to be really fun. Lots of betting. Betting's going to be a really cool thing. But, uh, yes, absolutely. I'm sure you guys will love it. Yeah. So. Uh, anyway, thanks again for watching. Thanks for sticking through this with us, especially through all those te technical difficulties. And we will see you guys again tomorrow for Friendcraft Friday and Skyrim again on Tuesday. The lesson tonight is even if it was a cheesy victory, it was still a victory. It was still a victory. <laughs> Namaste, everybody.